How's it going, my friends? This is Anakis, and today I'm doing a review for Masters of the Universe Origins Scareglow. I got him uh, a while back, and uh, I don't remember who picked it up for me. If I got him, or one of my buddies got him for me, but this was a figure that. I was really looking forward to because he was a favorite of mine when I was a kid. Uh, the original is now is super expensive. I no longer have mine, but strangely enough, I still have his cape and his axe. So I need to find myself a loose, decent looking one cheap and I'm good to go. But uh, you can see there's the front of the box unpunched the card and see on the back is the artwork cross sell and description for the figure so uh let's go ahead and get him out of the package and check him out and welcome to ionicus toy reviews so here we have scareglow outside the package and you can see he looks really nice really Showing off the skills little details on his paint apps. He's cracking the skull. He's got the beady little eyes. It looks really good. Head is on, of course, a ball joint. You can look up and down. And go 360. The cave gets away, but that's minor detail. Well, there goes the axe. You do a T pose. Arms can go 360. There's a bend at the elbow. And the hands are on a rocker and they can go back and forth. Waist can do a 360. Kick up that far. And go back that far. And kick to the side. There's a bend at the knee. And you can rotate all around. There's a rotation in the feet and the boot cut. And the feet can go all over the place. Accessory wise, he does come with his staff axe thingy. Comes with his cape. I'll take that back off. Which I try to take off without taking off the head. But there you go. Take a closer look at the cape. Because now I can't get him to stand up. The original cape was cloth, which I should have. I thought I had it on my desk here, but it's not there, and I, I'll probably find it tomorrow or something. But cape was cloth with a stretchy thing here. The origin scareglow's cape is plastic, which I don't think I like. Oh, excuse me. But it has good detail though. It's not bad. This pops right back on. Uh, you know what? Let me get, have a second. I'm going to go get the original axe and show the differences on those. So I'll be right back. Okay, so here's the origins. Axe staff. 
kind of a light green color to it. And here's the original. Is a darker green, and it's not as long. And there's like differences in it, but you can almost say this one looks like a knockoff, but it isn't. That's the original. I think this thing's worth a pretty penny too, quite a bit of money. But. Actually comes with uh, this mini count double trouble, which we've seen before. But uh, Scare Glow here is one of the ones that's looking forward to the most in the Origins Wave. Him and Zodak, were, and they were two of my personal favorites. All we need to do is get a tongue lasher, and I'll have the three that I had as a kid that I took, like, everywhere. But, uh... I'm loving all the Origins for years. I'm not going to grade them, because they're all top-notch in my book. And my personal feelings, they're amazing figures. And I've been thoroughly enjoying all of them. If you liked this video, give me a thumbs up down below. Like, share, subscribe, whack the bell for notifications. And remember to head over to my Instagram channel, Anarchist Toy Reviews, for comparison shots and other toy related pictures from my reviews and live streams and just whatever and just remember to keep hitting those toy aisles and I'll see you guys next time later